RJ Fatima here talking to our public choice winner for the voice English junior category. This is Nisha. Hi, welcome. Hi. I am so happy to be here today, here today talking to you because I really want to know about your full GMI experience. So I'm super excited. Welcome. Congratulations. Great job. Yay. And that's on your win. How do you feel about winning the Public Choice Award? I felt really good because this was actually in my first competition singing uh -huh. music in front of a stage. Oh, wow. That must have been very nerve-wracking, huh? Yeah. Oh, well, you know what? I mean, I think it was a great and well-deserved win, so you should be proud of yourself for sure. Do you think you can maybe entertain our listeners with a small snippet of what you performed? We'd love to hear Okay, let me start. She's just a girl and she's on fire. Hotter than a fantasy. Loaded like a highway. She's living in a world and it's on fire. Filled with catastrophe. But she knows she can fly away. She's got both feet on the ground, and she's burning it down. Oh, she's got her head in the clouds, and she's not backing down. This girl is on fire. This girl is on fire. Oh. She's walking on fire. Oh, my God, that was fabulous. You have a great voice. Oh, my God, this is a well-deserved win. Do you, are you self-taught or do you take voice lessons? Um, I just, like, I don't really have any teacher for my lessons. I just go on YouTube and sing with the karaoke, so... Oh, that is awesome. Look at that. No formal instruction and you're self-taught. This is this is amazing. I'm really happy for you. Well, tell me a little bit about your journey. Like, why did you decide to do the competition? How did you prepare yourself? Who encouraged you and supported you? Tell me all about it. So I really wanted to do this um competition because I wish I, I usually do carnatic music and and I just wanted a change. So I decided, like, maybe I can do Western music for a change in a competition. So that's why I decided to do Western music in the competition. And also, um, the one that encouraged me a lot to do this and helped me so much to get through this experience was my mom. And um, she did a lot of stuff for me, and I, I really appreciate it. Great. Well, see, you already have family support uh, encouraging you. So that, that is really awesome. How about the the platform itself, right? Should the Daisy Radio? Yeah. I mean, I think without them, I don't think this would have been possible for you, right? It would be impossible for me to sing. Yeah, that's true. Well, tell me a little bit about your experience. Like, how was it? Like, going on stage and being nervous, never having done something like this before. How did you feel getting up there and doing this? I actually feel really excited mm -hmm. because um, like, I really wanted to know how the experience would be like yeah. in front of a lot of people. Yes. Are you going to return next year? Maybe. Oh, so you're already thinking about it. Yeah. Okay. So tell me if you had other friends who were on the edge, they, they're not sure yet if this is something they want to do, what would what would be your words of advice? I would just say maybe you should um, start by going to a competition to see how it feels like to actually sing in front of a, like a lot of people so right. they can like actually feel the experience so they can move on to more um performances that makes sense uh did you like participating in the global music icon yes i loved it 
Okay. Oh, that's that's awesome. What was your best part? What was your favorite part about participating? When I was like saying this girl is on fire, it just all my emotions found out and it was felt really good. So yeah. That's awesome. That's good. Now, do you have like a favorite singer whose work you follow? Yes, I have two favorite singers actually. It's Ariana Grande and Taylor Swift. I'm sorry, which one? Oh, Taylor Swift. Yes. Is she coming to a city near you for a concert? Yeah, I think she's coming to Detroit on June 3rd. Do you get to go? Not really. Well, she was just in Nashville, and I went to one of her concerts, and it was absolutely So I hope you get to go sometime, if not this year, maybe the next time that she comes around. So that is awesome. Do you have a favorite song of hers? Um, Probably Snow on the Beach and Midnight's. Yeah, uh, that's a good one. I don't think that she did that one, but yeah, I mean, it's a very popular song. Awesome. Well, uh, tell me a little bit more about how often do you practice? Do you have a schedule as to what you did, a, a list of things maybe that help you prepare? And I don't really have a schedule or something. Whenever, like, I have some free time, I literally, I kind of go, sit, like, I practice some, like, lines, and I try singing it, then I sing with the karaoke, and pretty much get it from there. Okay. Do you have other songs that you karaoke to? Um, not really, but I, I'm, I'm going to try some more. Yeah. Well, next year, when you come back, you're going to have a different song for us, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's just unfair if you don't treat the audience to your lovely voice. So we're definitely going to plan on seeing you again next year. Yeah. Okay. Do you have any particular friends at school or anybody else that might have encouraged you? Okay, so I told my friends about my, like, the thing. And they said, good luck. And they really hope that I win. So, yeah. yeah did, did, did they vote for you? What? Did they vote for you on the public choice? Yes. <laughs> That's what friends are are for, right? They support, they encourage. In addition to family, that's the next best thing we are. Well, it looks like you had a largely positive experience. And you are self-taught. You didn't have formal instruction. But yet you went out there and you used this platform to your advantage to showcase your talent. And I'm sure you'll do many more great things in the future. So I'm really very excited that you decided to participate and that you won. And uh, I feel like you'll do really, really well uh, moving forward. So good luck to you again. And it was lovely chatting with you. Congratulations on the win. And we hope to see you at a future GMI competition, okay? Thank you.